welcome to our today's class and this is the first unit this is the first topic in physics and so remember that this for revision purposes only if you need more notes you need to download the app and check out the notes as you can see on your screen right now so welcome to our class physics from one topic one introduction to physics and we are going to know what physics is we are going to study about the branches of physics and how this physics relates with other subjects and technology and finally we are going to uh, understand why we need to why we are having this class this topic these subjects in high school and where this the study of this should lead us and finally since we are going to interact with a lab a physics lab we are going to understand the basic safety rules that we need to keep while we are in there and so by the end of this topic you should be able to explain what the study of physics involves relate physics to other subjects and to technology identify career opportunities related to physics state and explain basic lab safety rules and so physics is a science if you remember what you the the, the subjects you are doing in primary school you remember that you just had one science mathematics social studies and all that and so physics is a branch of that science that we we all did in primary school and so in high school we have three sciences biology chemistry and physics and so what is physics physics is a, is defined as a study of matter and its relation to energy and by studying matter in its relation to energy we, are, we, are, we should be able to explain how and why the following happen the falling of bodies towards the ground daily occurrence of tides in the sea why we are able to use a drinking straw to sap up any favorite liquid that we may think of at the moment and so physics has quite a number of branches i'll just mention a few mechanics involves the study of motion of bodies under the influence of force electricity and magnetism deals with the relationship between electric currents and magnetic fields thermodynamics is the study of transformation of heat to and from other forms of energy geometric optics under this topic we are going to understand or to study the behavior of light as it tra traverses various media and so tell me down in the comments what waves is about and what atomic physics is about and so next we'll look at the relationship between physics and the other subjects and technology and so i'll pick those in both and you tell me about the rest go back to your notes your class notes and remind yourself what the other five or rather four talk about and so physics and history carbon dating is an application of radioactivity we are going to study about radioactivity in form 4 and so carbon dating as a tool as an application of radioactivity serves as a crucial tool to historians in establishing fossil ages and past patterns of life physics and home science and so physics knowledge has been applied in the design and manufacture of domestic equipment that is pressure cookers microwaves even that sufuri you are thinking about right now physics and chemistry Physics has helped in explaining forces within atoms and therefore atomic structure. 
physics and biology knowledge of lenses has helped in the making of the microscope microscope which has assisted in the study of the cell the basic unit of life that will find it we we'll learn more about that when when we get to our biology classes and so why are we studying physics we are studying physics so that we may able to acquire skills that should help us get into some of these careers i'll just mention a few of my favorites bachelor of medicine bachelor of pharmacy bachelor of science in nursing bachelor of science in computer science bachelor of science even in tourism let's see some more bachelor of science civil engineering bachelor of science in electrical and electronic engineering when you get to campus they call it i think they call it triple e or ee -E -E. when you get there you remember that bachelor of technology civil and structural engineering and so to the last subtopic basic lab safety rules one proper dressing must be put on two the locations of electricity switches firefighting equipment first aid kit gas supply and water supply system must be noted three while working in the lab windows and doors should be kept open four any instructions given must be followed carefully five never test eat or drink anything in the lab six ensure that all electrical switches gas and water taps are turned off when not in use never plug foreign objects into electrical sockets keep floors and working surfaces dry then all apparatus must be cleaned and returned to the current location of storage after use lab equipment should not be taken out of the lab any waste after an experiment must be disposed of appropriately hands must be washed before leaving the lab and so that is it for our first topic our next topic will be measurement one and remember to download your app so that you're able to do this revision on your own get more notes get more revision questions past papers that's a link just go to google play try that link see you